Get you down here. Okay, we'll switch you. And then you can upgrade. You can go down here. You'll go here. You will come down there. Put you there. We'll get you there. You can get upgraded. Go there. Go there. Come there. Perfect. I have internet problems. Can't watch. Oh no, dude. Internet problems are the worst. Okay, well, we're getting close to our war. I just basically now need to finish upgrading everyone, and then we're good to go. We might look at get doing a joint war. We'll see. So you need to come down here and get upgraded. We'll move you most of the way down, and then promote you. Look at Barding because he has so many archers right now. You need to come up here. You come here. You come there and skip. Then we'll just bring you down here since you're already upgraded. I love the horse sounds right now. It's like, ah! Actually, they sound like donkeys now that I say that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure those are donkeys. Are these being. They are donkeys! What? The nine consistent wars between Samaria helped develop the innovation kill that spread across the ancient world. Chariot, more like a four-wheeled cart pulled by donkeys. Huh. I didn't realize that that was the case. I just kind of always assumed they were horses because chariots always had horses. That is interesting. Huh. Today I learned. It's kind of hilarious how much, like, history knowledge I've learned from Civ. skip uh you're good you need another turn you can heal up inside my territory oh yeah i forgot we can't heal outside territory anymore that's fine please please We're please please continue to move your units right next to my borders you're not gonna regret that in the slightest bit man Okay, so let's move you. Let's swap you. We'll upgrade you. You can come down there. And we probably want like two or three on the flank. We might want a couple units over here. Um, I definitely want to wait for this encampment to finish before we go and attack. Probably, let's grab you and bring you back over here. Yeah, and in fact, I might actually move a couple of these knights this way. We don't need this many on the left side. Uh, all right, let's finish off wheel. Since you're already boosted, you're going to come down there, and we are almost ready to go here. Now, the downside is our knight's going to take full damage from his spearman, but <laughs> yeah, that's not really a concern right now. The question is, how do we want to do this? <sighs> we have three archers, which means I can eradicate this guy right here. I think that's what we do. The Spearman has 25 base strength. We have 15 melee strength. So him attacking us on the hill, we're going to get plus 5 because of here. Are we an oligarchy? So we have plus 4 there. Does he have oligarchy? He does not. So we're at plus 9 then because of that. And then we'll have another plus 3 because we're in ideal terrain. So, our 15 is going to actually be uh, 27 compared to his 25. Well, plus 4, 29. So, he'll do a little bit of damage to my archer, but not a lot. So, I think our plan then is we will take these three archers. We will murder this guy. Um, we should have no problem killing him in one turn. We'll then put our knight up here and we'll fortify him. Hopefully, he'll attack our knight on the hill. Our knight is going to get 48 plus 5 plus 4 plus 3. So, in other words, he's going to take no damage. And then we use the rest of these units just to start squishing the crap out of his um, archers. Do we need a swordsman? I don't know. We have the gold, so we might as well. We also have a lot of gold again. So, we might want to save up to 920. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. 
You were, uh, hold up, you're leveled, so you come down this way. You go here so uh, you can upgrade this turn. And then you're still coming down here. That's fine. Go, 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 good. Uh, all right, let's fortify up. So I think we have a plan in place. Now, he could all move his units here in a couple seconds, and then, yeah, but we'll figure that out this when it happens. is the version um, of past events that people have decided to agree upon. Okay. Does that change anything? Where is he going with it? He can't settle anywhere over there. He can come down here with him, but I can eat him up. He might be trying to move through me. So, in that case... Hi. <laughs> he might put a city up here, which... Alright. Although, you might end up flipping my city if we're not careful. I'll put you in Berlin for now. Let's just get you back to 100%. Clone's not flipping, we'll be fine. That's a scary sea of knights. <laughs> yeah, it was a scary sea of war carts, which has now become scary sea of knights. Um, yes, yes. I would agree with this. Give me engineering, even though I don't need it. Germany's gonna die. There's no question on that. Um, the big question is, are we gonna continue on into Norway? Probably. He doesn't even have walls up right now. Yeah, he doesn't even have walls right now. Dude... Yeah, that's so bad. Oh, we can't joint war. What? I don't have the tech. I have it with you. Harold. That's Germany. No, that's Norway. <clears throat> so, I don't have the tech to joint war yet, is what you're telling me. Where was that one? I forgot when that one showed up. Is that a tech or is that a... After researching foreign trade. So we have it, so why can't we declare it? Yeah, no, we do have it. So why can't I offer it? Maybe because he denounced me? I suppose after he denounces you, you can't declare joint war. All right, that makes sense then. And uh, Germany and Mapuche must not have the ability or they might not know who Germany is or have seen Germany and maybe that's what's going on there, I guess. I don't really know. I'm just kind of spitballing right now. We'll send you down here. You got a couple extra builds, which is good. Um, I'll take you here. And then you guys were going this way. So I want you to come down here. I want you to come down there. Uh, we're trying to bait that guy into coming over there. You're going to come up here and upgrade. And then you guys are going to be my wave down here. We'll send one more there. And let's just keep you here. Yeah, I'll be fine there. And you still got three more turns. We might just launch then. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what we're waiting on right now. We definitely want to wait at least one more turn. Next turn, we might go for it. Unit maintenance, we want to leave. Settlers, we're still producing. Yeah. 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 Loyalty, I'm not gonna... We're spending so much money right now. I, eh. Then again, we're making 67 gold per turn. We are making 45 of it from Germany. So our income is going to drop significantly as soon as we declare this war. Uh, and we're spending 27 on units. So that would be 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33. In other words, I don't think I want to switch. So. Okay, you are <gasps> we're out of gold. No! How dare you, game? That's fine. You go grab that one, then. I uh, know. I don't care. And I don't care about any of these. Plus loyalty. We don't actually need extra loyalty. So I might as well keep banking up envoys at this point. Even though we don't even have a city-state. We've not even seen a city-state. I can still eat you. I think that's fine. You're just going to fortify up, and you're going to heal. And I guess we do this now? We brought another archer out. We can't heal outside our own territory. Oh, we need to denounce him, don't we? Why are we not denounced? Okay, well, we gotta wait five turns then. I don't want the heavy warmongering penalty. 
it doesn't really matter, but I would... And here's the other thing. We might want to wait 11 turns just to have an alliance. Just so they like us a little better. Are we going to get a size 10 pop? Probably not. Ah! So six turns, but... Yeah. ZZQQZZ, what is up, dude? I love the Jeff pictures. The Jeff emotes. Yeah, we're just gonna stay here then. Um, but let's move you then down this way. We do want to make sure that his uh, settler gets eaten by us, but I'm not super concerned yet. In fact, we can come down here just to make sure when he moves this guy this way, we're gonna be able to jump on him. Uh, you go back to auto explore. I need to bring Jeff out for one of these live streams. I keep leaving him back in the front room. I still don't know what to do with him during the live stream. That's my only thing. Okay, so he did come down here. That's probably okay. I mean, I'm not like, uh-oh, we're going to lose the game because we lost a settler. It's kind of like, eh. It's annoying, but not into the world. So let us start looking at industrial zones, I think. So where would we want to put this? Here is going to get us one, two, three, four mines. Plus an adjacency bonus. Unless... Which city was this? No, no, no. Yeah, let's do it there. Other option would potentially be over here or down there. We could also look at grabbing a campus, and this would be a pretty nice campus. Now, but the industrial zone will allow us to build a campus quicker. So let's start with that, and we'll need to start popping out some mines, too. Uh, luckily, we just got what we needed. I'm gonna build. We should rip up the forest. Yeah, let's chop the forest. It'll speed that along. We're good here. You're good here. We'll go next. And our city's gonna be going. We need, what, four more turns? Three more turns? You know what? I might just bring you all the way down here now that I think about this. Because we don't really know what's over here. So, having an idea what's over there might not be the worst thing for us. And especially if he's moving the settler that way. One night's not going to be end of the world for us. Yeah, do a little exploring. Okay, you're going to go back up there. You can come there. And then you can come over there. And then you're going to settle. You are losing loyalty. You'll be fine. Uh, we can keep Amani just kind of going back and forth. Worst case scenario. Uh, machinery isn't the worst thing for us. Mathematics gives us the Petra. We could go explore over water. I think let's grab a uh, crossbowman. We don't need it. We're not going to need it, but we'll be fine. Do we want encampment here? I don't think we need it. Yeah, I don't think we need it. So in that case, give me the water mill. Get a little extra production. You also have rice, so that's going to be a lot more food too. That is going to be nice for us. Uh, give me a monument. And to a granary. Uh, I don't think we need... We could put him here to chop out this industrial zone a little bit quicker, but we'll have to wait five turns. Yeah, I think that's fine. Not doing anything else right now, so... Can you get upgraded? Yes, you can. You are a level three knight, which is crazy good. And we still need, what, like two more turns? And we're good to go? Go on something like this. Yeah, there we go. Dude, he's gonna get destroyed. <laughs> uh, I settle where I please. I do what I want, man. I don't listen to you. You're not my boss. Okay, I see you. Mains is gonna be so easy to flip. That's a really cool city, though. That's an awesome, like, I love this mod. Like, uh, that's a really cool looking wonder. And that's such a cool city to have on it. So, we'll end up conquering him when all is said and done. Give me the barracks for the combat experience. Ah, stable. We already have so many melee, or er, ranged, or. Er, seriously? Seriously, right here? Uh, but we already have so many cavalry. We might as well just keep the cavalry train going. And then you guys are all just going to sit here fortify. Please. Thank you. Uh, you were doing fishing boats. 
and you keep working that tile, which is giving us a little culture, I just don't think it's worth it. I think I'd rather you work these two. Like, give me food right now, man. Keep growing the city. When you're a little bigger, you can afford that. Now, the thing that sucks about this... I guess we can put a couple farms. We just have no production here. We'd have to buy up to this style. We might want to buy to the fishes, to be honest. Um, I think I'm going to skip, though, your use, and let's go grab the rice. Yes, you can have an embassy. So, we are eight turns away from civil service. Meh. I don't think we wait for the alliance, even though I said we should. Norway declared war on Babylon, or Babylon declared war on Norway. We still can't do this for another one turn. Okay. Alright, let's get ready then. Give me the water mill. Because I don't think we... Eh, we could use one more settler. Maybe two. We can also start settling down here as soon as we start grabbing these German cities. Magnus isn't upgraded, so we're not getting the boost on that right now. Or the, um... The boost where we don't lose the population, so... Yeah, and I think we definitely come in this one. So, we want to sleep you. Which I'm just gonna skip your turn so I don't forget. Um, I need three turns and then we're gonna... Once you're established, then we're gonna go take it. Mains is losing loyalty right now. Hmm. Are you at war with Norway? Yes, you are. Okay. That is totally okay. So I'm going to leave you down here and we might be able to jack mains from him. Another barbarian encampment spawned. I can't turn my volume up. I can't hear this. Way the heck up there. Great. <laughs> Great. Well, we know what we're going to do as soon as you're done. Killing this guy. Bye. You're gonna come up over here. Thank you for the gold. I appreciate it. All right, let's do this. <sighs> Formal war. Hold up, before we do that. Nope. Frederick Barbosa. Yes, so he'll do this. So yeah, 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 let's do this, man. Joint war, Frederick Barbosa. What would you give me for this? What do you want for this? I'll give you 320 gold. He doesn't want it. All right, screw it then. Okay, let's go. We already have all this planned out, so you're definitely gonna die in one shot. You're gonna come up here and fortify. Um. We didn't plan out the rest of this. I could grab the worker. I don't care. I think I'd rather start squishing his units. Oh my god, that's a one hit. <laughs> Eek. Eek. Ew, god. Oh, I'm so sorry, AI. Not really, but oh man. Dude, we did 99 damage. Oh, you were so lucky. You were so lucky. Actually, come back here so you don't get shot by Magnemberg. Put you there. We're not losing loyalty, so that's okay. Uh, you're going to fortify up here. We could hit the Spearman and do a ton of damage. I would rather him attack me and take the damage himself. Put you in the forest. The city's going to fall so quickly. Um, we just need to get the battering ram up here so we do full damage to it. No, ho, 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 ho. Way too early. Way too early? What are you waiting for? I have... What, what, what do you want me to wait for? Uh, oh yeah, we're waiting on the force. We could build the rice. And in fact, you're working the rice. Yeah, you don't screw it. While you're waiting, go build this. We'll go back over there. Send an envoy. <gasps> we met someone! We... <laughs> and we're at war with them. But we met someone! What is up, dude? I'm still at work, Brian. Wait for me. Dude! It's like... 6, 7, 7 o'clock GMT, so it's like 9 o'clock your time right now. How are you still working? Oh, yes. 
I think we wait one more turn and I think we can jack mains. If I attack it now, obviously I don't take it. I don't think he can take it next turn. Uh, the Spearman's not that strong. So we should be able to steal this from him. <laughs> Ooh, I didn't even notice you. Yeah, I want to come kill you. And we're waiting on everyone else. Alright, let's go. How are your archers now, punk? Oh, his archer actually got hit by Babylon. Or, uh, Norway. Okay, well that did an okay amount of damage, but... Can we stop doing, like, 99 damage on these guys? That would be great. Alright, you're fully sieged, so we can now start hitting this. Who did you attack? You did attack my archer, that's what I thought. That's fine. We'll shoot the city then, even though the walls don't matter. Squish. Nom nom nom. Um, we're going to continue to wait. His archer here does have me slightly concerned, but we should be fine. Let's kill you off, just so our archer doesn't take any more damage. And then we'll come here with you. We could pillage his traitor out too. But we should be able to pillage it next turn here. Uh, I think I have to retreat just so you don't die. I hate that, but sure. And we should probably start going right on the walls, right? Right on the city. God freaking heck, man. Look at how little damage we're doing. Ugh. Hey, walls, man. So how do we do more damage to the city? Then we need the uh, Siege Tower, right? Man. I was like, hey, we'll not worry about the walls. Screw that. Attacking melee unit ignores walls and immediately assaults the city. Wait, what? That's the Siege Tower. We have the uh, Battering Ram. So that's... Oh, that does full damage to the walls. Okay, I confused them. So why aren't we actually doing damage to the walls then? Whatever. There you go. That's why, because it was showing us taking out the walls in one hit. That makes a lot more sense. I was so confused at how he was taking that much damage. <laughs> okay, I'm feeling so much better about this now. And we just basically one hit, one turn flip this. I should not maybe waited a turn because we could have pillaged the traitor out, but eh, it's fine. What is up, Germany? Oh, God, it feels good. Man, that feels good. All right, money man. We got to make sure we don't fall behind on tech. That's going to be the one thing that's going to screw us. Yeah, we need to keep our science going. Now, is that going to grow our cities? Because technically this counts. Do we have an additional growth or do we have to like finish the war? We're getting 15% growth. Hanging gardens. I was never 100% on that. Yeah, 15%. Okay. I wasn't sure if, A, you ever got the bonus of a wonder you didn't build. I thought you did, but I wasn't 100% on that. And then I also wasn't 100% whether or not you got the bonus right away or if you had to wait for the um, um, war to end. So now we should be able to hold on to mains, I would think. Well, we could definitely move Amani off Berlin and put her down on mains. Yeah. I probably want to take one more unit over here as well. I just don't have anyone nearby. It'll be fine. Mm, okay, so we're going to get you to come here because we're going to prepare to come take Magnemberg out. <laughs> Your ancient walls, dude, are so cute. Uh, I got to move you inside the city, though, so. Or inside the walls. Um, We don't have any repairs needed. Let's just put you in the city for the time being because I'm not sure how this war is going to shake out and what we'll need and where we'll need it. You're coming up here. Yes, 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 yes. Someone built Temple Artemis. It's going to be a wonderful wonder for us to take someday. You're denouncing us. That's fine, because we're going to have a war on you here pretty quick. You shoot in my encampment, you little punk. Might as well heal you up. Yeah, we might as well give them a little bit of HP they need. Um, Do we straight go for the city right now? We need to get this over here. That's gonna take a little bit. So let's let's just chill for just a little bit. <laughs> I 
You suck, you know that? You freaking suck. He ran away into freaking Norway. Oh my god. Alright, hey, uh, Norway, can you please actually do some damage on mains? Sims! What's up, dude? Give me some quiche. We actually can promote you now. We have enough? Yeah, we have enough to promote you. Don't have to worry about healing. Uh, you are established. Goodbye. So that immediately finishes the industrial zone. Nice. Let's go knock out the workshop. We're going to go for our bonuses here. And then we're going to work on a campus there. Might as well start moving you over. And... Actually, we might want to heal everyone first. I mean, I could literally spend one turn healing these guys. That's how little damage they took. Yeah, let's do that. You need to get inside the city so you can heal. Can we shoot mains from here? I don't know. I don't know about that. Uh, we're gonna have to move you out so I can get our archer going in that direction. Alright, cool. Still at work. Oh, that sucks. At least it's a Thursday, not a Friday. I want the stone, don't I? Yeah, I want that stone. Also, you are still coming over here. And I have a few guests who want to have me over for a glass of wine. <laughs> Dude, you can't say no to wine, man. You can't say no to wine. The question is, what kind of wine? You guys just all heal up for the time being. Mapuche denounced Norway. We'll have to see if we get denounced here. Hey! Remember that people break down too. Not just machinery. Jonathan, thank you for subscribing. I appreciate that. Uh, you're gonna get inside here. I didn't need to move you in there, but whatever. Uh, you'll get inside there. You'll heal. You take your one turn to heal. Do we surround the city? Yeah. Yeah, we go. I don't need my archers. Because we one hit the walls on this city. <laughs> oh, it's so wonderful. Gosh. I am so happy we rushed out knights. I am so happy with myself right now. Uh, okay, let's send you down here then. Thank you. I appreciate that. And Mains is going to be mine next turn. And goodbye, Germany. Ooh, 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 I need a pillage. I need a pillage. No, I need to pillage him before we end this war. I don't even think I'm gonna worry about moving my archer up. Like, why? Ooh, we can upgrade a crossbowman. Uh, would I rather do that? I think I would still rather upgrade you to a knight. Because we do have a kind of beefy unit here to take care of. I'm working tomorrow as well. This is true, but I mean, one glass of wine shouldn't get you tipsy for tomorrow. Unless you don't have food with it, which then it's always possible. We'll grab mathematics. I don't think we're going to end up trying to get the Petra, even though we have ridiculous Petra cities here. Like maybe in Cologne, perhaps? There's a lot of desert tiles. I just don't think. Surely someone else is building it right now. Let's start working on some builders. We also want shipbuilding. But you know what? If we're going to do the Petro, we might as well start it here soon. Uh, I definitely want to keep popping out builders, though, because we are builder-starved right now. You want a mine here. That gives you another plus one. Um, might want to save up some money and just get some builders. All right, so we should start looking at our war on Norway, because that's going to be what's next. You just fortify up right now. And you just fortify up. We'll get you here. Build some ziggurats in the desert so you get more science and culture. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 good point. 